Hey everybody, welcome back to the Traveling to Sea channel, where we love to travel, love to share. Traveling is great on land, sea, and air. Come with us as we go and see together how much better our traveling can be. Our European vacation 2023 to France, Germany, Switzerland, Austria, and Italy included Bodensee, Garmisch Partenkirchen, and Neu Schwanstein Castle. In this video will cover our traveling to those three locations. And uh, my wife Emily and I decided with my son Brandon and his wife to plan a trip to Germany. And as we planned, the trip grew. This video captures our experiences driving from Zurich, Switzerland through Switzerland and Germany to Bodensee. Then on to Garmisch Parkenkirchen, and then a tour of the Neuschwanstein Castle. So come along as we relive this fantastic vacation. The vacation began in Paris for three days, took a bullet train to Saarbrücken, to Baumhorter, Rhine River Cruise, Wertheim, Zurich, and now the Bodensee and Garmisch. We've got videos on the previous things, but the 179 miles, 288 kilometers from Zurich to Garmisch. Beautiful, beautiful drive all along the way. And here we are, we're beginning out of Zurich, found this covered bridge. How fascinating. And the countryside is just Absolutely beautiful. And you can see there's vineyards. And now we've got a view of Bodensee as we're getting closer. Fascinating, isn't it? There's a, there's a European motorhome. We can see more mountains. The further east we go, more mountains, beautiful, and here Bodensee, and also known as Lake Constance, and it's four countries in one lake, four country region. You've got Switzerland, Germany, Austria, and Liechtenstein, all surround Bodensee. They've got. They're open 365 days a year, and there's a lot of activities there. Here's a map you can see the Bodensee Ferry. We went from Zurich, Switzerland, and we're driving to Garmisch Parkenkirchen, crossing Bodensee. One side of the lake you've got Constance, and the other side of the lake you've got Friedrichshafen. We took a ferry from Constance over to Friedrichshafen and back. Here's a panorama shot. There we are, right by the Bodensee. Just having a wonderful time. And we stopped to have some lunch right along the river there. This was the menu, the restaurant Stadtmauer, and boy we ate good. Look at these dishes. Yum, how delicious they were. Then we decided, hey, let's take a ferry go across the lake. There is a uh, Zeppelin, a blimp up there. So here's the ferry, and now we're on the ferry. It was a beautiful ride. Took, um, I don't know, about a half hour, I think, to get clear across the lake, a very sizable lake. And there's See that it was pretty open that day. You see the boats 
along the way, the beautiful views all along the way. And it was hot. We were there in July and uh, it was air conditioned that ferry. That was wonderful. And we arrived and here's the beautiful scenery. See the boats out in the water. There's that blimp again. And we found some spaghetti ice there. We always enjoy some spaghetti ice. There's a shot of us there by the Bowden Museum. Well, then we took a drive on to Garmish. It's a, a beautiful countryside as we're driving along, leaving Bowden And the further east we go, the closer we get to the Alps. So you can see more and more mountainous areas. We come up to a tunnel. And we came through the tunnel and then we really started seeing more and more mountains. And it's beautiful. Of course, we're, we're heading there. We had to go through Austria. There's this toll, the border. We went through Austria a bit to get to Garmisch Partenkirchen. And more and more mountainous as we go. And the Zugspitz is the highest point in Germany and it is near Garmisch Park in Gerken. It's just beautiful countryside, isn't it? Awe inspiring indeed. Look at that. Beautiful. Yes, yes, it is indeed beautiful. Finally, getting closer, and here we are pulling in to the Edelweiss Lodge there in Garmisch Parking Church. So Garmisch, and here's a, a website that will tell you all about Garmisch and the sites around Garmisch. Two separate towns, Garmisch and Parking Kirchen. And they've got much to see. You saw the zoot spits there. And there's Garmisch, right down near the Austrian border. 
and we stayed at the Edelweiss Lodge and Resort. It's a U.S. Forces Resort. You can see the inside. It's beautiful. There's a panoramic shot right off our balcony. Pretty awesome, isn't it? Pretty awesome indeed. Those are ski slopes right across the way there. There's some shots at night going into the facility. It is wonderful. You have to be active duty or retired armed forces to be able to go to the Edelweiss Resort. They offered a Neuschwanstein Castle Tour, bus tour, there from the lodge, which we took. But this video is getting too long, so I'll make another video on the Neuschwanstein Castle Tour. But I've got some YouTube video recommendations for you. Happy to wander. She's got some excellent videos for travel all over Europe. And in particular, her, her most helpful video was the 101 Europe travel tips and must know for first time. Samuel and Audrey's Travel and Food Channel. They've got a lot of great videos as well and they've got one on Lake Constance. Bowden's A, really good. And Bucket List Urban Adventures. They have got a video on Garmisch Parkinkirchen. The top 10 things to do in Garmisch Parkinkirchen. Great video. I hope you enjoyed this video. This has been our review. Bowden's A. Garmisch Park and Kirchen and upcoming next video we'll have the Neuschwanstein Castle experiences. We enjoy it. Hope you did too. Watch for our future videos and check out our playlist on all of Europe. Comment below, share your experiences. Have you been to Europe? Have you been to Bodense? Have you been to Garmisch? Keep traveling. Keep sharing. God bless.